A police chase involving a suburban police department ends in a crash in Milwaukee. Now, thankfully, no one was seriously injured, but the crash certainly left its mark. Our Angelica Sanchez has more on the ongoing investigation. Vehicle going eastbound on Hampton Approach. There's no one. A Milwaukee Department of Public Works crew was working during the bitter cold to clear the area where a vehicle crashed into a whitefish based squad car. According to authorities, this unfolded after midnight Friday morning. A Whitefish Bay police officer tried to pull over a vehicle for a speeding violation, but the car refused to pull over and a police chase began. 192, we're going to need North Shore here. Uh, two vehicle TDO. The chase came to an end when police say the Whitefish Bay police officer was approaching the intersection of Hampton and Teutonia. Police say as the squad slowed down for a red light, another vehicle traveling southbound on Teutonia collided with the squad car, knocking down what appears to be a traffic light. Debris was scattered everywhere. Dispatch. Uh, we're going to need uh, one ambulance here. I've got a subject in a vehicle complaining of chest pain, airbag deployment. The strength of the impact was felt by both the driver and the officer. So the person in the other vehicle is going to just be the use of the officer might have one and another. Unfortunately, the driver of the suspect car got away. According to the police chief, both the driver and the officer that were treated at a nearby hospital were released Friday morning. Reporting outside the Whitefish Bay Police Department, Angelica Sanchez, Fox 6 News.